In this video, I will show you how to create a shader for the hull of a starship. I'm working on a bigger project with Star Wars Frigate. I completed the region around the bridge and the rear. There is still a lot of work to do, but in this video, we take a closer look at the shader. Open a new Blender project and delete everything. Switch to Material Preview and add a plane and a new material. Enlarge the lower window and select Shader Editor. We can keep the principal BSDF. Add a Voronoi texture and change the method to Chebyshev. Ctrl T for the standard node setup. And we need a color ramp. Click on the little arrow and select Flip Color Ramp. Change the interpolation mode to constant. Connect the distance output with a factor and the color output with the color input of a principal node. When we pull down the black slider to the value 0.673, we can see an effect on our plane. Increase the scale in the Voronoi texture to 8. Duplicate the Voronoi texture and the color ramp for more detail. Connect the mapping node with the lower Voronoi and add a math node with the operation multiply to combine the two color ramps. Increase the scale in the lower Voronoi to 10. You can play around with the sliders of the color ramp for some variations in the patterns. Now we need a mix RGB node. The value output of a math node controls a factor. Choose a darker color in the upper color field. If you like, you can duplicate the Voronoi texture and the color ramp once again to add more details. With this Musgrave texture setup, you can add some imperfections to the surface. The most important settings are a dimension of 0.3 and a detail of 15. For the lower Musgrave texture, I used a different mapping node with a translation and a different scale. The color ramp behind the Musgrave are connected into the color inputs of a mix RGB. This shader can be applied to the hull of our starship and we can proceed modeling. 